Hello everyone and uh, welcome. I'm Tabitha, I'm the prayer coordinator within Every Nation Ghent and I'm so glad you joined us for another Monday Prayer Day. The passage of today is out of Matthew 9 verse 36 to 38 and I want to make three points about this passage. The first one is that we see that Jesus had compassion. The whole passage is started with Jesus looking at the crowds and seeing them being helpless and harassed as a, as a sheep without a shepherd and he had compassion on them and out of that compassion he turned to his disciples and he said you know the harvest is ready pray the lord of the harvest that he will send workers into the harvest field are you praying with a heart that is filled with compassion because it doesn't take long when you talk to other people to people um, that you know that people are going through some real heavy stuff and they are still helpless and harassed because they don't know the Good Shepherd. The second point that I want to make is that the, Jesus says, pray to the Lord of the harvest, um, that he will send workers out in his harvest field. Notice how God sees the world different than we often see it. He, it is his harvest and he is, he is the Lord of the harvest. It is his, not ours, not the devil's, but his. His, he is in control and when you start realizing that that will change the whole way how you pray because you will know that he is ultimately in control and we need to know that then lastly the last point that I want to make is that Jesus says the harvest is ready the harvest is ready now not yesterday not tomorrow it is now when I think about a harvest that is ready um, I I think about the fact that at one point it wasn't ready, then it was ready, and then it isn't ready anymore. It is gone. And you have to seize the moment. Think about an apple, maybe a fruit that is more familiar, at least it is for me. When I think about an apple, at one point it is ready to be taken off the tree. And when you don't do that, it, is, it falls on the ground. And after a short while, it starts to die, it starts to rot. There's an urgency with which farmers need to get the harvest in when it is ready because if they don't they lose the harvest they lose the fruit and it is with the same urgency i believe that jesus is saying to the to to the disciples pray pray to the lord of the harvest that he will send out workers so that the whole harvest will be taken in i want to challenge you today if you feel that you are lacking compassion when you think about people who don't know Jesus or if you feel like you are lacking revelation that he is in control that he is the Lord of the harvest or that there is an urgency about this season then I want to challenge you to meditate on this passage this week and to start praying every day that God will send out workers in his harvest field I hope this encouraged you and helped you have a nice week